Jesus was in Jerusalem for the Passover feast. One night, a religious man came to see Jesus. The man's name was Nicodemus. Nicodemus was a Pharisee. He studied and taught God's law, and he tried very hard to obey the law. Nicodemus wanted to know more about Jesus. Rabbi, he said, we know that you are a teacher who has come from God. No one could do the miracles you do unless God were with him. Nicodemus had that right. Jesus said, I tell you, unless someone is born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. Now Nicodemus was confused. He thought that keeping all God's laws was how a person got into heaven. Besides, what Jesus said didn't make any sense. How can anyone be born when he is old? Nicodemus asked. Jesus said, a person cannot enter God's kingdom unless he is born of water and the spirit. Whatever is born of the flesh is flesh, and whatever is born of the spirit is spirit. When a baby is born, he gets physical life from his parents. Physical life doesn't last forever, but the spirit gives people a better kind of life, spiritual life, so they can live with God forever. Jesus said, don't be surprised I told you that you must be born again. Nicodemus still didn't understand. How is this possible? He asked. Jesus said, when you don't believe what I say about things I've seen on earth, how will you believe what I say about the things I've seen in heaven? Do you remember how Moses raised up the bronze snake in the wilderness? Everyone who looked at it was healed. Like that, the Son of Man will be raised up so that everyone who believes in him will have eternal life. Then Jesus told Nicodemus about God's great plan. Jesus said, God loved the world in this way. He gave his one and only son so that everyone who believes in him will not perish, but have eternal life. God did not send his son to declare the world guilty, but to save the world. Anyone who believes in him is found not guilty but anyone who does not believe in him is guilty already. Nicodemus needed new life, eternal life, but he could not do anything to earn it. Eternal life is a gift that comes only from God. God showed his love in this way. He sent his one and only son to save the world. Everyone who believes in him will not perish, but will have eternal life.